Bran, I think. Will you help her? Provided it's not too late. Thanks, Johnny. And good luck to you. Likewise. And if you happen on any water hags, give them a nice fat walloping on me behalf. Farewell, Witcher. Did you learn anything? Just as I thought. The crones probably cursed your mother, took a lock of her hair, then disappeared down the stairs. Cellar under the house. Cellar doors hidden. In that case, we have no time to lose. Come. <laughs> Let me go in first. Give you a shout if I find anything interesting. So be it. Let's begin. By the eternal fire. I've never seen so many before. Looks unsavory. What is all this? The trappings of a black magic ritual. Witches weave human hair through dolls the first curse. They gain a grasp on individual souls this way. Think one of the dolls represents Anna? Can we free her if we find it? It's the only way I know of. But there are risks involved. The items woven into the dolls, see them? They symbolize the individuals the dolls are meant to represent. We must find the doll that is Anna and take it from here. This risk you mentioned. Take it we only get one shot at choosing the right doll. I'll not chance it. I did not know Anna. You've learned much of her. Should find it easier to choose. All right. Let's take a look at these dolls. Hmm. Red bead attached to this one. Anna wears a string of those around her neck. As do half the women from Novigrad to Wengerberg, this cannot be the one. Ah, uh, all right. I'll look at the others. Hmm. Bird feathers woven into this one. If I had to bet on it... I'd say this doll represented Philippa. Philippa Eilhart, if that's true, then... Relax. First name that came to mind, that's all. Philippa's way too clever for the crones to have snared her in some trap. Besides, we're not here for Philippa. We're here to save Anna. And I can't think of any link between her and bird feathers. That might seem obvious. But what if it's a ruse and this doll, in fact, symbolizes Anna? Doubtful. Crones would have no reason to employ trickery here. Should look at the others. Hmm. This is interesting. 
A doll with a flower. What's so interesting in that? Not just any flower. A violet hollyhock. Baron once told me it was Anna's favorite flower. Mm. And you believe this to be the doll? Might very well be, but I can't be sure. Should look at the others. Human ear attached to this one. Belong to one of the peasants, doubtless. Anna still has both her ears. Let's look at the others. Hmm. This is interesting. A doll with a flower. What's so interesting? Not just any flower. Hmm. And you believe this to be the doll? I'm sure it is. Taking it. Quick, outside! Mum, you're back. All will be well. You're going to be fine. Tammy, I'm dying. She's not well. Raven doesn't rightly know what's happening. You're weak yet. You must rest. No. Listen to me. The crones. I was to be their beast to the end forever. You broke their spell. But now I must go. Well, what's she talking about, Witcher? deceived us. Their curse is a death sentence. No way to lift it, at least not in a way that would let Anna live. We broke their spell temporarily, partly. Now it's gotta run its course. What? What does that mean? She's dying. It's good to see you together. I'm sorry, Annie. For everything. I'm sorry. Mother. Tammy, do you remember that day on the inner? Of course. Those plums are so sweet. In your dress so blue. You wove me a wreath of flowers. <laughs> we laughed the day away. Please, remember me like that. I thank you. They had a chance to say goodbye. It was your doing. Shame I couldn't do more. Come, child. The eternal fire will soothe your pain. Leave me be. Your pay will await you at Crow Perch. Collect it there. None of this is your doing. I know. Which makes it no easier to bear. The pain will pass in time. I'd like to believe that. I would. You may have a moment with her. Then we must bury her and return to Novigrad. Very well. Let's give her a moment. Faster.
That's it, Roach. Time to end this. <laughs> 